2000. Glad to have you here today. I'd like to introduce you to the coolest co-host around. Give it up for Lucy! Give it up, give it up! Here we go. First up, we got Marissa. How you doing? Hey, I'm great. Good, good. Tell us about you. Um, I'm in sixth grade. I have five cats. My favorite subject in school is science. Five um, cats? Oh, wow. I have two brothers who are extraterrestrial. Cool. And once I took <laughs> surfing lessons from a guy whose name was Kahuna Bob. Wow. Hey, are they green too, Marissa? <laughs> Little Green Brothers, good to have you here, Marissa. Yeah. Good luck to you today. And Gerard, how you doing, pal? Well, I'm in the sixth grade. I like math and science. Mm -hmm. I play baseball and basketball, and I love spending time on my computer. All right, cool. very well rounded. Good to have you today. Good luck to you. Finally, we got Vinny. How are you? I'm doing hey, good. Vinny. How about you? Tell us about good. yourself. I. I'm in sixth grade. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. I like to surf, golf, and play baseball. All right, good to have you here. Yeah. Good luck to all of you guys. Yeah. Today. Here's how you play the game. You spin the wheel, you pick a letter. Now, if that letter's in the puzzle, you get the points. If you solve the puzzle, you get to keep those points. That's important because you win a prize there, but you get to go to the big prize at the bonus round at the end of the game if you have the most points, okay? Here's what we got on the wheel today. We've got our call waiting. That's our physical game. Then we've got the website, www.wheel2000.com, which you guys at home, you can log on to anytime you want to. But today, if you guys hit it, a lucky emailer gets a chance to win with you. We also have the loser spot on the radio. You hit that, we have to give you the big L, and we skip you. And finally, the big bad creature beneath the wheel. Ugly, you hit that, you lose your points, and you lose your turn. All right, that's how the game works. You guys ready to go? Yeah! All right, let's Marissa. Do this. You won the coin toss backstage. That means you get to choose from our first three categories. Lucy, can we see them? Here we go, Marissa. First three categories are Measure It, Globe Trotter, and Bright Ideas. What do you like, Marissa? How about Globe Trotter? Okay. Here, Here we go. Globe Trotter. Let's see that purple. All right, globe, globe, globe trotter it is in the wheel. Blue, blue, blue. Let's go. All right. Come on, Marissa. Let's get it started. Globe trotter. It's a big word. 500, Marissa. A T? Yes, Marissa, there are two T's. Two T's. Two T's, that gives you 1,000 points. Plenty to buy a vowel or you can spin. Um, I'd like to buy a vowel. Which one? An E. Yes, there's one E. Turn mm. the game off right. Nice job. I'll spin. You do it. Go for it. 700. Is there an H? Yes, there's one H. H. All right, that gives you 1,450. What do you think? I'll spin. Okay. She knows what she's doing. Yeah. Get past it. Nice job. 550. Is there an R? Yes, there's one R. Mm. Okay, category Globe, Globe Trotter, you got 2,000 points. What do you think? Um, I'd like to buy a vowel. Which one? Okay. An A? No. No A. Sorry about that, Gerard. She was Your on a turn. roll, though. Come on, let's go. Okay, Gerard, this is call waiting. What's going on is we've got a famous person waiting on every single telephone line for you. Now, your job is to figure out who those famous people are. How do you do that? You pick up the phone and you say, who's calling? Once you figure it out, you yell it out, and that's when the randomizer, which is shuffling up letters over there, will freeze and give you a letter. Now, here's the trick. The other phones are ringing at the same time. Each phone only rings four times. So you have a decision to make. Keep listening to the person on the first phone or pick up one of the other ones. Got it? Got it. All right, let's put one minute on the clock. Come on, Gerard. What? You have a chance to get up to three letters. On your mark, get set, go! Ah, Who's your first one over there? Who's calling? Uh, I was born in Italy. 
I worked briefly as a map maker in the Portugal. In the 1492, I convinced the Queen Isabella of Spain that there was a festival in India. Columbus, Columbus is right. Yeah. 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 That's what? Who's calling? When I was young, I worked as an apprentice in a machine shop. In 1892, I built my first automobile. I made a lot more of those automobiles when I invented the assembly line. The car I designed in 1908. <laughs> He's going for the other phone. Who's calling? 30 seconds, 30 seconds. My brother and I operated a bicycle repair shop in Ohio. We got tired. Wright Brothers. Wright Brothers is rough. Right. Who's calling? Here we go. 15. Although I served in the United States Congress, people remember me best as a frontier. I served under Andrew Jackson in the War of 1812. Seven. I was known for my backwoods Five. attire, which Four. included my famous racket and skin hat. Who's calling? Who was that last one there? I think that we were looking for Davy Crockett. That was what we were looking for. Ah. That's okay, Gerard. You did great. You still got two letters from our randomizer, a P and an N. Let's go put him in the puzzle. Nice going, Gerard. Way to go. He rocked on the Wright Brothers, man. He was like, Wright Brothers. He rocked on that one. Yeah. Nice okay. job. Nice job. Let's see. I think the other one we we're looking for was Henry Ford. That was the car oh. guy. But you did great. You got two out of four. Nice job. Now, you know the, the drill here. You got a P and an N. You want to stick them in, or do you want to spin and pick a new letter? Uh, let's try and stick them in. Let's see what happens. P and N, Lucy. Okay, I can give him one P, but no N. P. Pretty good. Nice job. You got 250 for that P. So now that means you can buy a vowel or you can spin. I'll spin. Go ahead. Get your right. Sweaty from answering all those phone calls. <laughs> 250. Is there a D? No. No D. Sorry about that. Vinny, your spin. Come on, Vinny. It's Vinny. Yeah. Woo. Woo. Yeah. Yeah. You hit the creature oh, beneath the wheel. Vinny. He takes all your points. You didn't have any, so he goes hungry, but you lose your turn. Marissa, it's to you. He's scary. He's scary, Lucy. He's scary, Davis. Save me. Come on, Marissa. Oh, oh you got a yeah. jump That means you're picking a letter. Hang on, you got to pick a letter in the puzzle first. <laughs> then you get the prize. Um, you got to earn I want, it. I want, I want. F? Yes, there's one F. Now you got it. You get 100 points, and whatever's in there, open it up. Let's oh, see what you on. got. All right, it's a personal video yeah. game system. Very cool. Nice job. Now, you've got 1,850 points. You can buy a vowel, you can solve it, you can spin. What do you think? Um, is there an I? She's buying an I? Yes, there's one I. Good job. Good job. Hey, I'll take that for you. Now. You used to have 1,600 points. You could spin. You could solve. What do you think? Is there an O? She's buying. Yes, there's one O. Oh. Remember, the category is globe jotter. What do you think? I'll solve it. She wants okay. to solve it. All she right. figured it out. The tropic? Tropic yeah. is right. Yeah. 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 There we go. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Lucy, what's up with the tropics? Well, my actress friend, Madeline Zima from The Nanny, has the scoop on this. Thanks, Lucy. If you look at a map, you will see two imaginary circles that lie parallel to the equator at about 23 degrees latitude. The Tropic of Cancer to the north and the Tropic of Capricorn to the south. These two circles mark the northern and southernmost boundaries of the region known as the tropics. That's where those tropics are. I always wanted to know. Well, Marissa, you did great. And your great prize to go along with your little video game system is a big video game system. Yeah! You get a video game now. Awesome. You guys stay right there because we got more Wheel 2000 coming right up. For more wheel, it's time for puzzle number two. You guys know how it works. Remember, the person who gets the most points at the end of all the puzzles gets to go on to the bonus round. And this round, great chance for some more points with a 2,000 point spot on the oh, yeah. Big points. 
Gerard, you get to go first this round, so let's take a look at our three categories. We have two old ones and one new one. Here we go. Measure it. Made in a USA. And bright ideas, too. What do you like, Gerard? Let's try bright ideas. Okay. There's your puzzle. Spin the wheel. Let's go. Four hundred. Is there an R? Yes, there's two R's. Mm -hmm. Nice job. Eight hundred points. You can buy a vowel. You can spin it. You can solve it if you're a big smarty pants. <laughs> I'd like to buy a vowel. Okay. Okay. An E? Yes, there's one E. E. Nice purchase. Takes you to five fifty. What do you want to do now? I'll spin. Do it. Go for it. Go. Five hundred. Is there an S? Yeah, there's two S's. Yes, yes. Stacking up the points, 1,550. What do you want to do? I like to solve the puzzle. Whoa! No way. What is it? Printing press. Oh, yeah! yeah. had to be copied by hand, making them very rare and expensive. But around the 1440, Johannes Gutenberg invented the first printing press that could make lots of books fast and cheap. In less than 100 years, more than 10 million books were printed and sold. Wow. You know, that was actually new. I bought and read all those books. All 10 million by myself. Yeah, sure. Yeah, no yeah. way. Well, since you knew printing press so quickly, Gerard, you just won a water theme park season pass. Yeah! Wow. Have fun, Gerard. You guys stay right there. Come on back, see if you can solve puzzles faster than Gerard here on Wheel <laughs> 2000. for puzzle number three here on Wheel 2000. Let's take a look at the points so far. Marissa, you're doing good. Let's see, you got 1,350 points. Nice job. Yeah. Got that first puzzle on your belt. Gerard, 1,550 points. Got that second puzzle. Yeah, Gerard. Vinny, no points yet, but guess what? I got a cure for you. Right here, 5,000 points on the wheel. One spin, you're the big winner. That's all you need. And I'm even going to give you this. You get to go first this game. So you get to pick from our three categories. We got two old ones, one new one. Here they are. Here they are. Measure it. Made in a USA and word wrap. Hey. <laughs> what do you like, Vinny? Made in the USA. All right. He's an American. He's a good old boy. He's a good old boy. There's your puzzle. Spin the wheel. All right, Vinny. Here's your chance. Let's get it going. Here we go. An F? No! No, F. Marissa, it's to you. Right. <laughs> Go ahead. Come on, Marissa! <laughs> Marissa! Yeah! It's a lucky day. The prize box queen. Pick a letter. Is there an R? Yes! There's <laughs> one R! Open it up. Let's see what you got this time. Oh, she's it's a digital headset. Yeah. Cool prize. That's prize number two for you right now. You've got 100 points. Spin the okay. wheel and let's keep going. Here, I'll take that for you. Let me you just spin the wheel. <laughs> Come on, Marissa. Oh, Ooh, two fish. Is there a T? Yes, there are two T. Nice job. That takes you up to 600 points. What do you think? I'll buy a vowel. Which one? An A. Yes, Marissa, there's one A. Mm. I'll spin. Okay, go for it. Mm. 
Six hundred. Uh, L. Yes! There's one L! Man, she took me to it. Shoo! <laughs> Just in time, Marissa. That takes your score up to 950. What do you want to do? I'll buy a vowel. Which and one? E. Yes, there are two E's. E, E. Categories made in the USA. What do you think? Hmm. Um, I'll have to spin. Okay. All right, you go for it, girl. She's putting all the pieces together in her mind. I can see it. Out of that puzzle in mind for 5000 Is there a C? Yes, Marissa, there's one C! Mm. Yeah! Big points, you got 5700 What do you want to do? I'll buy a vowel. Which one? An I. Marissa, there's one I. You nice got it. Yeah! You still keep your big points up there, 5450 What do you think? Spin. Okay. Go for it. Steve, are you stressed out? That's what I want to know. I'm, I'm just trying to make sure she stays away from the creature, Lucy. I, I just don't want her to fall on the wheel or anything. <laughs> 600. Is there a B? Oh, Marissa, no. I'm not. B. Sorry about that. Gerard, to you. Still no point. Nice job. You hit the wheel, the website right there. You got a chance for one of our lucky emailers to win with you. Let's find out who we got. Lucy. Well, David, our lucky emailer is Laura Osborne from Toledo, Ohio. Gerard, pick wisely, because if you get this letter right, she's going to win a Wheel 2000 t-shirt and hat. Yeah! This is for both of you, Gerard. Pick a letter. Is there a D? Yes, there's one D. Mm. Nice job. You get 750. She's got the hat and t shirt looking cool. What do you think? I'd like to solve the puzzle. What is it? Cattle Drive. Cattle Drive? Yeah. 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 Lucy, what's up with the cows? Yeah, when the Civil War ended, America's in the East had a shortage of beef. Ha <laughs> ha, moo. Some businessmen decided to go west and gather wild Texas cattle and sell them back east but had a problem since the railroad had not reached Texas yet. So, the cattle had to be walked to the nearest train depot in Missouri, 1,500 miles away. Wow. That's like a cow marathon. Gerard, you want another one this time? You got a radio-controlled car. Pretty cool. Yeah. Zooming all over the place. All right, let's take a look at the scores right now. Vinny, great to have you here today. No points. That's okay. We got some cool stuff for you. Thanks a lot for coming. Bye. <laughs> Marissa, you did great today. Let's see. You got 1,350 points. You got the digital headset. You got the video game system. And you got the big fat video game system, too. You won a lot today. Thanks a lot for being here. But our big winner with 2,300 points, the radio controlled by the water theme park season pass, is Gerard. <laughs> That means we're going to the bonus round right after this. You come back here. Thanks for coming back. It's time for the bonus round. Gerard, you know how it works. Pick your prize, A or B. I'll choose B. He's going oh. with B. You hang on to that. You hold that right there. Lucy, show us the puzzle in the category, please. Here we go. It's place, Gerard. It's a place. Now, you know how it works. We give you R-S-T-L-N-E. How are we doing with those, Lucy? Okay, I can give him one N, one R, and one E. That's it, Gerard. Work with it. Okay, now you pick three consonants and one vowel. What do you like? A W. Uh-huh. A Y. Hmm. Um, let's see. A Q. And an A. Okay. I can give you one W, one Y. That's it. Okay, it's a place. Ten seconds. Talk it out. New York. New York City! Yeah. Yeah.
Entertainment, a Sony PlayStation, and Hercules video game. A season pass for four people to any Six Flags theme and water park in the country. A flashback racer including 9.6 volts of power, front and rear suspension, two channel digital steering from Nico. From Jeep Electronics, a portable boombox with cassette deck, CD player, AM, FM radio. The monorail PC with CD-ROM, color screen, stereo speakers, modem, and internet access. Hey, yeah, two rides in the house.